How's it going, everybody? This is Brian Funk, and I want to share with you a new free Ableton Live pack called Desk Drums. These are drums that you put right on your desk, and you can play with them, have a great time while you're at work. Apparently, these are the exact drums Phil Collins used in his hit In the Air tonight. Read that on the internet. So here we have the rack. It's pretty cool. You get the drums as they sound in their natural way. Those are the three drums. And then I've played around with them and changed the sound. We got the like, rim shots. They make a lot of noise. They squeak and rattle. So I got those into separate pads. And I've added some reverb, the cymbals here, pitched things down. We got all those different sounds there. Now what's cool about these is when you look inside the drum rack itself, you've got control over different parameters for every single one of these. So we can filter out, say this tom, bring up its resonance, we can change the filter type, and we can do quite a lot to affect the sound. There's even a drive, some distortion, filter drive. We can spread it to make it sound wider. Transposing is probably the most fun thing to do with these. Some funny things happen to these sounds as you pitch them around. You can easily pan them side to side. And finally, I have a repeat rate control, which if I just turn this up to say eighth notes, I can just hold down this pad and it will play it synced eighth notes to your song. That can be kind of handy. I pick like, a, say this sound, almost like a hi-hat type sound, right? So I'm gonna just click on it and we'll turn its repeat way up to 16th notes and then I can You know, I got like a hi-hat going for me automatically, which is kind of fun. If we look inside the sends of the drum rack, we've got a reverb, so we can add reverb to any one of these sounds. So here we got this sound, it has quite a bit of reverb on it. Here's a dry sound, which we can instantly put in a giant space. There's also this one called Glue Comp, and it's four glue compressors in a row cranked up with the soft clip on. That's important because that gives us this nice distortion. So if we take, let's say, this sound right here and bring up the glue, get that nice distorted heavy sound, which is what's going on on some of these samples. So essentially, as you start at the bottom here, you get the natural drum sounds, and as you move up through the rack, things get more and more affected and a little wilder and a little crazier. They're a lot of fun. I think once you start playing around with the knobs and bringing them into new territory, there can be a lot of cool sounds you can use in your music. I hope you have fun with that and enjoy. Enjoy.